Lincolnshire Police has had a drone capability uh, since uh, September 2017. Uh, in Lincolnshire Police, the drone capability has been received on a sort of organic timeline from its first introduction when it was first muted. People thought that it was a toy, it was something that we shouldn't be spending money on, and then as it was introduced more and more, as officers around the force have seen it more and more, the acceptance of it has become total and there's starting to become a reliance on it as well. So in terms of acceptance, where we are now from where we are, where we were nine, ten months ago, we're in a really good place. So in, in Lincolnshire Police, we've used the drone for a, a massive myriad of incidents. Um, I would say our primary, uh, primary taskings are search and rescue based. Uh, that's both for missing people, vulnerable people, uh, and also suspects that have gone to ground after they've run away from us. Um, but primarily missing people. We also do uh, pre-planned tasking. We look for cannabis factories, so the heat signature coming out of the, the, the large lighting situations that, that occur within cannabis factories. Uh, we use it around rural crime to prevent and deter hair coursing, which is a big problem for us in Lincolnshire. Uh, and, and we also provide operational overwatch for commanders at major events, such as um, the Lincoln Christmas Market, uh, and also for football matches at Lincoln City Football Club. So in Lincolnshire Police, our, our, probably our most notable and, and famous uh, drone use occurred in uh, February 2018. Uh, it involved a single vehicle car accident where the driver was seen to walk away from the scene. Um, it was a very cold February night, it was minus two, um, it was dark, the location was a rural location. A witness had seen the driver walk away and we were unable to trace that driver. There was a fear that because of the state of the impact that the driver was injured. So the supervisor at the scene was aware that we had a drone capability. One of our drone operators was on duty and he was called to the scene. He was able to launch the drone uh, from the crash site, search within a 500 metre bubble of the crash site and just inside that 500 metre bubble he found a heat signature, albeit faint, in a ditch. He directed officers to that faint heat signature and it was the casualty from the vehicle. He was unconscious, he was hypothermic and the ditch he was in was half filled with water. That ditch had been searched by officers with torches and fire and rescue with handheld thermal. But because of the situation he was in at the bottom of the six foot ditch, they weren't able to see him. So the drone, undoubtedly on that occasion, uh, assisted in saving that man's life. So Lincolnshire Police has been helped by uh, Rusta drone training. Since we switched from our previous provider, Rusta provides a local provider for training, which is really important for us because it means that the officers are training and being trained and being examined in the environments in which they're mostly going to be working. In addition to that, because of the nature of the instructors coming from a predominantly military background, they understand our needs and they understand how the way we work, which means that when the training is given, it's given in, in, in a manner that our students understand.